Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here for another quick tutorial. Today I'm going to show you guys how to resolve the error you might get when there says that there's no such partition on your Windows device. So this is going to be a pretty straightforward tutorial and we're going to just jump right into it. So if you're wondering what's going on on the screen, this would assume that you have been able to power off or do a hard power off on your computer at least three times in a row. This will launch the Windows 10 automatic troubleshooting utility. So if you have not already done that already, you want to turn off your computer by pressing the power key at least three times. And then eventually you should be led to this screen right here that says automatic repair. Your PC did not start correctly. Press restart to restart your PC, which can sometimes fix the problem. You can also press advanced options to try other options to repair your PC. We want to select the advanced options button on the right side here. Underneath choose an option, select troubleshoot from the middle of these options. Select advanced options again. Select command prompt, use the command prompt for advanced troubleshooting. Left click on that. So now in our command prompt what we're going to do is type in bootrec.exe base forward slash fix boot then you want to hit enter on your keyboard. You should see the operation completed successfully. And now you want to type in boot rack again. Dot exe space forward slash fix mbr. And then you want to hit enter again on your keyboard. It should also say that the operation completed successfully. So at this point, you just type exit into the command line window or click on the little red X at the top right. So we're going to exit out of here. We're going to exit and continue to Windows 10 and hopefully your problem has been resolved. So I hope this brief tutorial helped you guys out and I will catch you in the next tutorial. Goodbye.